What is going on, everybody? Diesel here, and welcome back to a brand new video. Redeem Kadeem, the face of the franchise series, starts right now. I already have our avatar all created. Number 25, just like he was at the University of Arizona. Handedness is correct. His hometown is correct. We are looking pretty good. I'm going to go in here, show you guys what we're looking, what we're working with here. The only thing is I don't necessarily know if this is like the default for everything. If we can like switch some of this stuff up. Uh... I don't like any of these noses. All right, well, well, whatever. We'll go with that. All right. So there we go. We are looking good. His physique right now is set to balanced, I believe. Uh, height and weight is everything that is currently listed on the Calgary Stampeders website, um, which I believe is 59207. So that is all of his appearance loadout um, or his appearance. And then we're going to jump right into the league, start new career. Over here to halfback and see exactly what we can do. All pro skill level to start things off. We're going to go 10 minutes and 18 minute minimum clock time. So let's go see what we can do. Making the league is hard. Chad. Becoming a star is even harder. In legendary status, that's rarefied air. Only a select few get to breathe. All right. But there's an opportunity coming. And it's all about what you do with it. Listen, no one said this would be easy. You're going to have to dig and fight for everything to get noticed on a field full of legends. So the question is simple. Be honest with yourself. Do you really have what it takes to make the 99 Club? I guess we'll find out. I guess we will find out. Take a look. Thanks, Maria. No problem. Take care. Hey, sorry to keep you waiting, man. <laughs> you're a busy man. I'm trying to take care of my people. And right now, you're my number one priority. All right. So what you got for me, Sosa? Well, it's like we talked about. Rosters are just about filled at this point. But you're still in a great position. For the right number, just about every team in the league will want to have you. You've shown flashes of greatness over the last few years. And everybody knows if they bring you in, there's nothing but upside. No, oh, man. If it was nothing but upside, we'd have more than these one-year proof deals, though. Well, your playing time hasn't been consistent over your first four years. So they're not trying to commit long-term. That's all right. No matter how we look at it, it's nothing more than an opportunity, right? Exactly. You get to live right, in whatever let's go. city you want for a year. Yeah. You can choose to prioritize immediate playing time or look for whatever team has the best scheme fit for you. There's upside no matter where you go. Hmm. I guess that's how I should look at this process too then, right? Okay, so what's everyone trying to offer? All right, so we got a lot of contract offers on the table. Not all of them are created equal. Your skill level and position determine the grade, and A-plus means that you are the perfect missing piece. Scheme fit icon also means you'll have an easy time dropping into that team's existing strategy. You have a market value, which is base yearly salary without bonus a player at your position and overall should expect to make. Uh, we also get cred and rep for each contract so these are all one year prove it deals like we heard are uh in that cut scene so i think what i want to do i already have my team in mind uh, because i feel like this is going to be the the best spot for us to be at i was thinking the jets for a long time um but i don't know if that if that offensive line is going to be very good for us at the end of the day and quite frankly this Right here, this offer is going to be perfect. Uh, we should be getting... Um, so the Texans are a scheme fit and a position need of a C. So you take away all that. And uh, we're pretty much getting the same thing to play in the Pacific Northwest. So we're playing for the Seattle Seahawks. I think this is going to be uh, a great fit for us. We have a pretty good O-line. Um, a team that is rebuilding currently. 
and uh, gives us an opportunity to potentially be a star here in year number one and then see what kind of contract offers we get at the end of the day. We're not really here worrying about the Seahawks per se. We're worrying about Kadeem and getting Kadeem um, the, the best position possible. And I think right now the Seahawks are going to be that spot. NFC West, we get to play against some absolute studs. We get to play against, obviously, the Rams, the 49ers, the Cardinals. There's going to be a lot of fun stuff going on here with the Seahawks in the Kadeem Carey face of the franchise. So let's go ahead and take yeah, a look. To be here. I'm excited to get started. Yeah, I'll catch you later, though. At how everything is going to play out for our boy Kadeem. Just the man I've been waiting for. Oh, hey, I, I'm... <laughs> I know who you are, that's my job, but you don't know me yet. I'm Andy Kisner, Director of Player Personnel. Oh, nice to meet you, Andy. Likewise. We're really happy to have you in the building. Thank you. I'm ready to get to work, though. Love the culture you guys have here. I think it's going to be a great fit. Well, that's our belief, too. So, look, we've got a lot to do today, so we got to get moving. You ready? Yeah, let's do it. Let's go. It's a little hot hop jump Coach there. Coach Carter! Hey, Miss AK. So, you probably already know this. It's not like you're a rookie or anything, but as director of player personnel, I take great pride in making sure my players are taken care of on and off the field. Take a request, community outreach opportunities, travel plans, anything you can think of, I can help with it. I'm here for you. Okay, bet. I appreciate it. Like he said, said, okay, bet. Was a big nice. Part of my decision. Well, it's not just me. It's throughout the entire organization. So let's get you into gear. We want to give you a chance to make sure you got everything you need for game day. Thanks, Andy. Of course. Looking clean. Like that. All right, so I think this is the point where we get to select our equipment here for Kadeem. See what he's going to be rocking this year. Probably going to try to keep this as as clean as possible um, speed flex robot i like that we're gonna go with the dark do we go with the dark right here no mouthpiece eye paint we'll go with the crosses just because we'll go with the tight there tapered back plate is normal Arm sleeves, left sleeve, we'll go with the shooter right there like that. Boom, 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 love all of that. Right wrist, we will go wristband secondary color or white. Secondary color. Secondary color. All right, now we're gonna go. Boom. Like all of that. Put those. Can we go? Nothing. Tucked. All right, cool. Untouchable. Touchable threes, those are clean, we like those. And then I think over here, yeah, we can go over here, change this to Arizona, and we will be good to go. Going the wrong way, oh, no, we're not going the wrong way. I'm crazy. There we go. All right, so we got that to Arizona, we love that. Kadeem looking fresh. Looks good. Jump into Steelers week. An unexpected start. We can't really do anything else until we hit this. Hey, man. Did you hear about the trade news? I just saw it. Can you believe this? Look, I started believing anything was possible with player movement when Joe Montana was traded to the Chiefs. I was not ready for that as an eight-year-old Niners fan. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure. You know what this means, though, right? 
you're gonna be stepping in as the man. They're gonna give you the chance to shine as the starter, and you gotta be ready to take it and run with it. All right, we're we're ready to be Come the on, stars. Sosa. You've known me long enough to know. I'm ready for my moment. I'm ready to be a star. All right, I'm ready to watch you put on a show. I appreciate it, Sosa. And cheesy grin. All right, fast rising star plus two speed for the next game. All right, so we got some side activities now. We got to go in here, do our side activities. This essentially gives us stuff to do uh, during our open days. That gives us uh, some additional, like, plus three awareness for the next game for the team. We'll take that. So we're going to play some video games on this one. Let's do... Uh, Oklahoma drill that seems like it'll be fun and then open day for here plus three agility for the next game plus one speed plus two agility for the next two games yeah we'll do that one open day cryo treatment plus two strength plus one stamina um, plus two max stamina for the next game next game anything multiple games no all right we'll do this one and then that will lock in our activities Looks like we are a 73 overall here. Love that. All right, let's get these get these ready to go. All right, here we go. In practice. Oh, no way. He got off that block in a hurry. There we go. We still get gold, even though we missed one? There we go. That's We found it. There we go. All right, three out of four so far. Oh, get in there. There we go. This is the easiest rep we could possibly ask for, boys. Easy clap. All right, so we're up to silver with two more. I think if we get the rest, we should be gold, right? Quick little change of direction there. Turn on the jets and go. Yeah, so we get we get two more and we'll get gold. So we'll get 100 RP for this one. Oh, cut back. No, 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 no. Uh, so I think the best we can do now is silver. Man. We were so close to getting gold on our first one. Kadeem looks clean, though. I like that. Eight out of ten, so we got silver. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. All right, let's see what we can do here coming up. Got all of our bonus workout, our recovery in, plus three awareness, plus 50, plus two agility. Plus two strength, plus one max stamina. All right. Offensive coach intro. Hey, the new man in town is here. Welcome to the squad, big dog. I'm glad you wanted to be a part of what we build in here. Yeah, that was an easy choice, man. I see the potential this offense has, and I really feel like I can help take it to that next level, you know? I knew this was the place to be. Good. Because I wasn't trying to come out of retirement after one year. I know you have a lot of untapped potential. I told the entire office and staff, we needed you in this building. Hey, I appreciate that. I'm ready to put the work in. Well, it's time to put that work in. What you do in practice and in the preseason, gonna set the tone for the type of season you have. 
Let's make it a good one today, all right? I'm ready to go, coach. Yes, sir. <laughs> Okay. Okay. All right. So let's go. Side activities are done. Uh, let's go. We're not going to be able to view goals. All right. So if we get 10 yards. We got 10 yard goal, which is easy. A medium goal is 10 yards after contact, and a hard one is going to be rushing for a touchdown. So let's go. And we'll just keep it 10 plus yards. Preseason game number one. All right, so all we got left is uh, jumping into this preseason game, so. Nice. Oh, Mitch Trubisky. The new face of the Steelers organization. All right, let's go. Preseason. Scoring drive gives us 50, and then we got to rush for 10 yards. So let's see what we can do here with Kadeem. Got to make some plays here. We got to remember to, to go away from TJ Watt, right? Oh, no. 6-7, bro. What are you doing? We got hung out to dry. This side, this is the side we're going to go to. Mm. Not it. We're going to try the screen. Get there, get there, get there, get there, get there. Oh. Fourth and one. Let's go for it, go for it, go for it. No? Oh. Felt like we should have been able to go for that. Fourth and one in the preseason? Come on, coach. All right, scored. Break two tackles. Rush for a touchdown or 20 yards after contact. Let's see if we can get a touchdown in here, boys. Oh, block him, block him. There we go. Oh, that's a flag. Give me those extra yards. Personal foul. Unnecessary run. That's right. Can't be doing that, Mika. Oh, no. Offense not not helping us out. Get through there, boys. Let's go. We are just a little bit faster. I honestly think we could have broke that and we could have been gone. Oh yeah, if we were just like a smidgen faster, we could have just, we could have broke that and been way out of here. Ah, oh, we gotta fall forward on those. This is it quick pitch? I don't know if this is gonna work in a trip set, but. Nope, J.J. Watt. Or T.J. Watt. It says we have eight rushes and a touchdown. 
Did it give us credit for a touchdown? Oh, do we catch that? First down. Oh, man, that was nasty. There we go. Two receptions, 25 yards. I mean, oh, just in front. Perfect throw. We got to get in one more time, boys. Get out of here. Let's go. Nice stiff arm there by Kadeem. Should we bounce? I don't know if we should bounce it outside. Last time we bounced it outside, it was kind of a problem. Let's go inside zone. Gun inside zone. There it is. There it is. No, we couldn't break through. Ah. All right, third and goal from the three. And they're taking us out. Ah, oh, man. They took us out. Third and goal from the three. They took us out, man. All right. Let's see if we can get some more. Let's get like a first down or something here. Nope. Not there. 40 yards here in the first half, though. Not too shabby. Nothing we can do there. That's the end of the first quarter. That's going to do it for our first preseason game. Looks like we're going to take the win, although it's preseason, so it really doesn't matter too much. 23 to 7 as time is coming to a close 23 15 final so we'll see let's take a look at what we did in this one rushing we had 13 attempts for 37 yards and a touchdown so i mean it gave us credit for a touchdown but we didn't get we didn't get in for a touchdown so so i don't know we got some side activities, and we're going to meet our offensive coordinator. So let's jump into some side activities real quick. Wide open days. We have two. We have two days. Just two days. Uh, let's do Oklahoma again, because that was fun. And uh, strength. We're going to pump some iron, boys. We're going to go out and look like Arnold. Yeah. All right, it's enough of that. Back out here on the practice field, Oklahoma drill again. Get out of here. There we go. We got to get our speed up. That's what we need. We got to get some speed, some spin. Ah, there we go. You know what's funny is I hit. I think I hit turbo too often, too soon. Ah, there we go. That was a little bit better. Go closer to our center. And then, oh, I cut. Oh, no. I got cocky and I cut a little too fast. All right, let's go. We have that. What? I didn't step out. Come on. I think we're doing worse this time. I'm just start diving, boys. I'm just gonna start diving in. So we can still get silver. Can't get the gold anymore. Two more. Here we go, 
There we go. Let's go. And we're in. We're in. Don't mask. Give, give us a silver. 8 out of 10. All right. We are 77 overall. Coming into our next preseason game against the Bears, our former team. This is a big one, boys. This is this is a big one. Take a look at what our offensive coordinator has to say. All right, everyone. That's it for today. Hey, man. You got to do your homework tonight, all right? Get some rest. I mean that. So, how you feeling? <laughs> I'm feeling blessed, coach. That's what I like to hear. Hey, man, you've been gaining momentum all throughout camp. And it's clear you got the physical gifts to be a really special player. Thanks, coach. I'm ready to be a big-time playmaker for this team. Oh, I know. Bruh, the things you do out on that field, oh, man, can you turn some heads. But, hey, you got to remember, there's always another level you can get to. And if you do that, <laughs> I just know our offense will explode. Just tell me what I got to do, coach. Well, for starters, you got to carry yourself like you're the top dog. That means on and off the field. And you got to prepare yourself that way, too. I got you, coach. I haven't put the playbook down. I got it with me right here. <laughs> I believe that. We just got to keep seeing it on the practice field. Eventually, that'll lead to game day. Hey, man, I'm excited for this season. I know it's going to be good. That's what I'm here for, coach. Let's get out there and make some noise. Let's do it. That was the most awkward interaction between two people in my entire life, number one. Number two, I don't think I've ever seen an offensive coordinator act like that. And all the all or nothings I've watched, hard knocks, no. All right, guys, so it is Bears week. Our side activities are done. Everything is set up. We are ready to go. But I'm going to leave it here because preseason, we have Kadeem Carey going up against his former team, the Chicago Bears. I know it's preseason action, but I want to have a big game against the Bears here. So next episode is going to be finishing up preseason, getting us set up for week number one of the NFL season. So if you are enjoying the Redeem Kadeem face of the franchise so far, hit this video with a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe for some more Madden 23 content here on the channel. We also have the Commanders franchise coming a little bit as well very excited to get all of the madden 23 content off the ground hope you guys are as excited for it as i am thank you guys all so much for hanging out and as always i'll catch you guys later